Now at 5.30, a former Claremont school official facing serious charges tonight for a racy holiday party with students that allegedly got out of hand. Good evening. This is the KTLA 5 News at 5.30. I'm Cher Calvin. And I'm Sandra Mitchell. This is really unbelievable. Parents say minors from Claremont High School Choir were served cocktails while male strippers performed. The charges include providing alcohol to underage teens and lewd conduct. KTLA 5 Shelby Nelson joins us live from Claremont with more. Shelby. That's right. Uh, Steve, or excuse me, Stephen Lanusa resigned back in December, but now two months later, we are hearing from the Claremont Police Department about those formal charges filed against both him as well as the other two adults who were at the party. Now, in less than an hour, we do know that a board meeting is scheduled to get underway here at the, the district office right in Claremont behind me. The board members tell us that they do not plan on talking about this because it is, it is not part of the agenda, but we are hearing that parents could arrive here later on today to talk about it during public comment. Their charges filed against the now former board president of the Claremont Unified School District, 62 year old Stephen Lanusa. He faces two counts of contributing to the delinquency of a minor and one count of providing alcohol to a minor under the age of 21. That's after Claremont police say Lanusa held an annual holiday tree trimming party at his Claremont home on December 3rd with Claremont High School choir students in attendance to perform. But what allegedly happened at that party is what had parents fuming. Upon the student's arrival, Mr. Lanusa invited the high school choir group into his private adult party in his home. They were encouraged to partake in food and festivities. The students did not begin their scheduled performance until over an hour later and were offered alcohol by party guests among inappropriately dressed adult entertainers. During a special board meeting in December, parents airing their frustration saying students were reportedly forced to mingle with half naked male performers and were offered alcohol during what was supposed to be a fundraiser. Sadly, there is no apology that can help our kids unsee or unfeel the events that took place in his home with his encouragement while they were entrusted in his care. We knocked on Lanusa's door, but no answer. Two other adults at the party have also been charged, including 34 year old Blake Taylor White, who went by Buddy the Elf that day. He's charged with lewd and lascivious acts with a minor and annoying or molesting a child. This is a sick world that we live in, unfortunately. Parents picking up their kids from school today weighing in. It's surprising to me and it's very inappropriate. It's very surprising and it's kind of sad, you know, because, you know, those are our kids. Mm -hmm. We're supposed to be role models. And earlier today, the superintendent of schools for Claremont Unified provided a statement saying in part, we learned about the charges brought by Claremont Police Department against three individuals, including the former board member. It went on to say that throughout the investigation, the district's attention remained fully focused on the education of our students. Now back out here live, Lanusa, as well as the other two people charged in, in this case are set to be in court on March 30th in Pomona. Reporting live in Claremont, I'm Shelby Nelson, KTLA 5 News. All right, Shelby, thank you. Now